when I talk about urban transportation and, and smart cities, I, I think transportation is a fundamental component that would link and be common across all cities. So I think to first be smart, I think we need to be better first. We cannot be smart before we are better from where we are. Technology will play a very important role in terms of linking us and, and enabling all these uh, features that would be playing a key role in, uh, in, in urban transportation. Now, we all hear about analytics. So today, for example, we receive data from approximately 45,000 vehicles plying on the streets of Delhi. These include buses, these include autos, these include public service vehicles, these include RTVs. And, and, and if, I, if I were to give you a quantum of data that is received, it's approximately 50 uh, to 60 GB of data per day that we receive. We got to process it. We received 90 million location units alone from the autos that ply in the city of Delhi. And these, these are all coming from the GPS devices that are installed there. Now, what do we do with this data? It is meaningless and the city is not going to be smart if I just receive the simply the location of where this auto was at this point of time or where this bus is at this point of time. So what, what has DIMTS done, and, and we have a team of data scientists, we have a team of 10 people who are from the IITs working with us. I too am from an IIT Kanpur background. We, we have joined the IMTs essentially that because we see a lot of analytics that can empower the user on the street. So 80% of the commute that happens worldwide happens in buses. It is the most efficient means of transportation. If I were to do an investment compared with an investment that goes in a metropolitan railway network or a LRT network. At DIMTS, when we receive these data, we have tried to see that this data ultimately reaches through smartphones to begin with in the hands of the commuter by way of a mobile app. So we have an app which is available on Google Play called Nextbus. It is available, Nextbus Delhi. It's available for free. What it does is, it simply tells you if, you, if you are a regular user, you type in your route number of the bus, it will tell you the approximate time of, estimated time of arrival, next five minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, or whatever it is at your next bus stop. You can click any bus stop that is on that route. You can plan your, plan your journey. So for example, you, you have gone to, you are generally a car user and you've gone to Select City Walk Mall and uh, you, you sort of, uh, you know, you, you have to take a public transport, maybe God forbid your car broke down or whatever. You don't know where you have to take the next bus from. You simply just type in there, I'm at Saket, just type in Saket there. It'll tell you all the buses that will ply from the nearest bus stop also. So it'll tell you this bus stop is 300 meters from you, 400 meters from you. You want, where, what is the destination, what is the approximate fare, etc. So empowering the commuter is the key to making a city smart. There is no point in generating lots and lots of data. We hear about big data. In summary, I, I would say that technology is a key enabler in urban transportation, but it will defeat the purpose if the variety and the volume and the velocity with which the data is being generated does not reach the consumer and does not benefit them.